This one might be a lot of work to do, but we'll find out. I want to build a really long rock skinny. Oh man, it has been, I don't know, three weeks since I started this project of the uh, Rock Garden Skinny. And um, I've had so much go on that I just haven't been able to get back to it. It's The weather has definitely changed. Almost all the leaves have fallen off of my trees. This is pretty typical for trees, uh, walnut trees. They tend to get their leaves last where I live and they lose them first. So. I've had a lot of leaves on the ground that I've had to clean up over you know, the last couple of weeks. I still have a lot of work to do because they just keep falling, but I want to get back to this. This is a, definitely a big project just because of the uh, size of the rocks and stuff that I have to get. As you guys can see, I've already got several of the big rocks here. I've got some really, really big rocks that I want to get over here and I just could not get them in my gorilla cart because they're just too heavy to lift up so i went over to my dad's and he has a dolly or a i don't know some people call them a hand truck but uh, actually it's, it says hand truck right there so i guess this is officially a hand truck but uh, i don't know if dolly's a brand or what but anyways i'm back at it let's get these bigger rocks over here i have some cool plans for this this is going to be a very unique uh, skinny rock garden type thing. I hope it works out, but I have to get back to work on it. Let's do it. Wow, this thing is so heavy. Ah, this thing's it's gonna work good. Just have a long trip to get it back. Holy cow. I do think that's the biggest rock I've got.
is gonna be tricky, but fun to ride. Just getting these put in place and I'm going to come back and add like rocks, smaller rocks along the outside, uh, like a pile, piles of them. That way it holds everything into place, shove some dirt and rocks in between all the crevices. That way these rocks won't have a chance to move. The ones further up here, like this one, it's pretty stable because I dug most of those in the ground. But these, I just kind of sat there and then as needed, I'll fill them in and make them uh, a little bit more stable. And then whenever we go to ride it, it will definitely be very, very stable. I'm super happy that it actually is taking me all the way back to where it is. I was a little bit worried that when I got all these things stacked together that it was going to be really difficult because I was going to have to get twice as many rocks as I thought. But I'm actually on track and with these rocks I should end somewhere right there which means I only have like a quarter maybe one third of the distance to go so I might only need like 10 more rocks that are really really big the little rocks will just be tedious to pick but I think uh, I think all in all the the big rocks are the ones that are definitely the most difficult um, yeah those little rocks are just going to take time but I've got my gorilla cart for that which will make it a lot easier looks good now I just need to sure up the sides and then it'll be ready to ride I think this little rock here is a perfect ramp up and we got a perfect ramp on the other side <laughs>
Yes, I'm done with it. That was so much lifting, but uh, check it out. I need to get a measuring tape out to see exactly how long that is, but if I were to guess, probably between 35 and 50 feet, maybe? That is a lot of rock. So. Stuck. Uh, there we go. <laughs> oh yeah, without that branch being there. Whoa, that rock's tricky. That's a lot better. Yes. <laughs> okay, that's about where you slow down. Yes. <laughs> that is so fun. Now start riding right there. There it is. Walnut Springs official rock skinny garden. I've never ridden a rock skinny garden before, but now there's one at Walnut Springs. If you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think about the rock garden. And if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. It really helps out my channel. If you guys like my videos and you wanna get them a little bit early and also help support the channel, go to patreon.com slash runbikemike. There you can sign up for as little as a dollar a month. It helps out my channel and you get some extra benefits and perks like early releases on all the videos. And again, thank you for watching. And as always, get out there, run, bike, build, and just have fun. We'll see you in the next one.